Hello YouTube, my name is Sean Connors and welcome back to the Outsiders channel. And uh, I got a video reply to my recent question um, from Emergent, uh, Emergent, um, Emergent Play, sorry, who asks about a throws back a challenge, which is a great question about which is better, a you know, having good players or having a good GM. And what quantifies success in this case is the enjoyment of everyone. That's, that's an absolutely brilliant question. And it's impossible to actually answer because, um, it, again, this is a matter of perspectives really. I think if if I'm being honest, um, I think as an experienced GM, very experienced GM, I, I'd like to believe, in fact I know, that I can take a group of of players, no matter what the ability, um, and no matter what the disruption nature of some of those player types might be, and mould a group together. I've done it countless times, um, and I understand how about dropping the game down to the level that they enjoy. But your question was that everybody really enjoys around the table, and that isn't always enjoyable to the GM. Now, if we take the reverse answer to this, and we say, you know, you have a great set of players, by definition what that means is the referee perhaps isn't as strong, what happens then? You know and I know the reality there is that the players can carry the game, they can actually carry the DM along for them, with them, and the DM can feel pretty good about himself, because he's not necessarily going to see the flaws that he has initially, because the players will carry him through, and he'll probably enjoy it more. So the truth is, when you weigh it up subjectively, um, in this particular case, I think most of the time the player's situation wins. If you've got great quality players around the table, I think that really elevates the game, and can elevate the DM. Of course, if you've got great players and a great GM, you've got an experience on your hands so worth having. Of course, a good, I'm recapping my own answer, of course a good GM could, can make the difference, and actually... You know, elevate the status of the game around him. But is it enjoyable to him personally? Sometimes not, no. It's not always much fun to do that. You know it's part of the experience, the journey of getting those players to a point where you're having fun, and that takes time. So I hope that answers your question. It was a very good one. It's very weighted. And I hope more people take you up on that particular challenge. Not just myself, as great as you throw that challenge at me, but it's a brilliant question for the audience at large. Thanks for, thanks for posing it. Sorry about the background noise. It's early morning, and... Um, I'm lucky to even get this video off. So take care of yourselves, happy gaming, and I'll see you all soon. Take care. Bye-bye.